this. Oh my word. Ooh. Oh, hello. Just had the weirdest dream. I uh, I dreamt that we, we won two games in our first two group games with North Macedonia and qualified for the knockouts. Mental. What a weird dream. Oh. Hello then and welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Saving Skopje. It's episode three today and we have made a flying start to life as the North Macedonia manager. Yeah, we've won two games from our first two games. We've got six points. We are qualified for the first knockout round. It's something I didn't see happening. I won't lie to you. I was thinking maybe we'll pick up one or two points from our first two games and then maybe have to get a result against Gary Megson's Holland team in the third group game. But no, here we are already qualified going into today's game. And of course, today there is a little bit added to it because it is me versus Gary Megson. The Battle of the Titans. Did I just call it the Battle of the Titans? It's me versus Gary Megson. This is going to be good. Let's have a look at the team that I'm going to play in today's game. Oh, before we do get into that game, let me just remind you that I do live stream over on Twitch on a Wednesday, a Saturday and a Sunday. It's twitch.tv forward slash plates. The link is down in the description too. If you can't be bothered to type that in and you just want to click it, come and hang out for three hours with me. All right, let's have a look at the groups then. Before we get into this game with Gary Megson, I just want to have a look at who's qualified and who's not. Group A, Italy and Switzerland are already through there. So I think if we win our group, we avoid Italy. If we come second, I think Italy are going to be our opponents. I don't know that for sure, though. We will find out after today's game. Belgium and Russia look pretty good in Group B, but that's not quite done yet with a game to play. We've also got us or obviously already qualified alongside Holland. England have qualified. They have beaten Scotland 4-0. This is a universe where Rory Jennings is very correct with his 4-0 predictions. Wasn't quite the way in real life, was it? Um, yeah, the less said about that, the better. But England are through in this one. Spain look good to go through. Portugal and Germany going through. Oh my word, look at this. Group F. France, zero points. They have lost to Hungary and Germany. The World Cup holders look like they are going out in this European Championship 2021 here. Let's get our team ready for this match up against Gary Megson's Holland team. That is something that I feel like is weird to say every single time. I think, though, it's a little bit boring, but I think I'm going to go with the same team again. We've won all of our matches we've played with North Macedonia so far. 1-0. So I feel like we probably shouldn't change it. I'm going to go with this. I'll see you when the teams are walking out. All right, then we are underway here. It's me versus Gary Megson. I'm going to encourage the team. Can we see Gary Megson on the side, actually? That'd be fun. Oh, my word. No, no. We're getting a red card, aren't we, in the ninth minute. Adami is the man sent off. And advantage Gary Megson. Oh, my word. I thought it was going to be Alioski doing that, but no. It's Adami getting sent off. Do you know what I'm going to do? I'm actually going to keep this, I think, pretty much the same. We're going to go with... Just a 5-2-2, two, two, I think. We probably should... Mm, we're going to keep it like this for now. I feel like if we go one striker, we are just going to really struggle to get out. So let's go with this, with two in midfield. Will we get overrun in there? Maybe. It's going to be a really uphill battle here. Gary Megson, is that him there? There he is, look. It's me versus Gary Megson. You can see us on the sidelines. Just, you know, just don't beat us by too many, Gary. Clivert in behind here, shooting, scoring, and it's it's 1-0 to the Netherlands. Just, you know, just don't beat us by too many, Gary. Justin Clivert with a lovely finish. He had a lot of space there. This isn't the start I necessarily wanted here. Gary Megson's probably loving it, though. Gary, you loving this? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know why. I'd, I still don't expect that. I really should. It's unbelievable. Good finish from Clive at 1-0. God, there's a highlight straight away, straight after this as well. Literally a minute later. Look at the space that these Holland players have on the ball. Bergwies into Depay. Depay into the back. It's 2-0. Just, you know, just don't beat us by too many, Gary. Inside 16 minutes, we're 2-0 down to the Netherlands now. And our morale is going to go through the floor. This is worrying. I need to change this and go more defensive, I think. Depay smashes it past the goalkeeper. It's 2-0. I encouraged them and they absolutely loved that. We've had actually a decent 15 minutes. I didn't change too much. We've had 15 minutes of now, you know, working our way back into the game. At least there's not been any highlights. We just need to take this easier. 2-0 loss in the grand scheme of things would be okay. Whether it stays 2-0, I'm not so sure. I mean, it probably won't. I mean, Holland on the attack now. It's blind. There's so much space. Van der Beek 
And the bait to Bergwies. Justin Clivert gets there for his 3 0 now. I don't like this. Clivert's got his second. Just, you know, just don't beat us by too many, Gary. I don't like this at all. I mean, it's a good finish. I'm not really sure what the keeper's doing, but it is a good finish. 3 0. Can we get to half time? Please, lads. Half time, 3 0 down. There's a highlight straight away. And we've thrown it straight to them. Of course, we have. We've got it back. Can we launch our own attack? Bardi. Over the top. Pandev. He's, he's fl is that a shot on target? Please just count that as a shot on target. I mean, our team is tired. We're 3-0 down. It's a big boot forward. Bergwies. Alioski's on a yellow. I thought he was going to get sent off. Memphis. That's a little bit loose. Tchaikovsky. Here we go. Pandev. Tchaikovsky. In for 3-1. It's a good save from Jasper Sillison. We've had a shot, everybody. We've had a shot. Oh, there might be one more highlight here. Bardi in towards... Uh, I'm not sure who it was in towards, but actually it's going to be a counter... Where is our defence? Oh, my word. Wijnaldum. He's missed it. Why? We had nobody back. It must have been a Damie that was set to stay back. And we literally had no one back from the set piece there. I will change that at half time. There's actually one more highlight here. I've got my hands on my head. I don't know why I'm doing this. It means nothing. Remember, this means nothing. If we lose this game, we've already qualified for the knockouts. Hatter board down the right-hand side into Bergwies. Tackled by Bardi, but I think it's going to come straight back. Blind over the top. Hatter Boer to the byline. No, back to Bergwies. Shoots. Hatter Boer. Back in for Memphis. Flicked on over the keeper and in. It's 4-0. I'm not sure about our goalkeeping performance today. Um, he's looped the header over the top of him there, Memphis Depay. And we're 4-0 down at, at half time. Just, you know, just don't beat us by too many, Gary. All right, I've made a couple of changes at half time. Alioski was on a 6.0, and I've also changed our striker up front. I've taken Pandev off for Triskovsky. Uh, Ristovsky, Triskovsky off the bench, scoring straight away. All right, what a change that has seemed to be. It's 4 1. Respectability slightly secured here. It's from a corner. Bardi takes it short. Ristovsky just kind of dribbles into the box, and there's Triskovsky to knock in the little tap in just off the bench. 4-1. Comeback. Is it on? I highly doubt it, but that is a lovely start to the second half. So we're into the 70th minute here. Not much has been happening in this second half, but that's not necessarily a bad thing. I actually think really what I need to do here is save legs because we've got some very tired players and we do, of course, have bigger fish to fry than this game. This game doesn't mean too much. I've actually got, by the way, I've noticed we don't really have a left wing back cover. Nikolov is playing there. He can't really play there. I've just made my third change. I'm going to bring Spirovsky on in midfield. All right, highlight here. It's Bardi and Spirovsky knocking it around in midfield. Ball forward. Trikovsky into Trikovsky. Very similar names. Trikovsky. Trikovsky. Lovely. Foot. It's 4 2. It's 4. We couldn't, could we? We couldn't. Could we? It's beautiful football. We played that around at the back for a long time before I started the highlight to show you. And it ends up with Tchaikovsky smashing it in near post here. 4-2 with 12 minutes to go. I think we're going to go attacking for the last bit of this game. We might as well go for it. Can we get another goal or two? At least make it interesting. There is a highlight. If we score here, I mean, it might be Holland scoring to wrap up the game and get their fifth. But if we score here, it's going to be a nervy added time for, for, for Gary Megson. Can we nick it? Blind. Klassen. So it looks more likely that it's going to be a, a Holland fifth goal rather than a North Macedonian third. But we can dream, can't we? Blind. Into Kla We've nicked it. Spirovsky off the bench, bringing it forward. It falls to Trikovsky. He's got Trikovsky with him. Trikovsky. Oh, Van der Beek with a big tackle. That might just... No, it won't. We've got it back again. I thought that was going to be the end of it, but no. Spirovsky, Trikovsky. He's offside. Oh, I, I knew I knew he was going to be, but I was hoping he wouldn't be. The linesman has flagged. I think this one's going to be offside and it won't be 4-3. There is a VAR check. It is goal disallowed. As expected, it stays 4-2. I think he was off. Can we check it here? Oh, it's close as well. Delict was the last defender. It was really close. Good finish from Trikovsky. He's been really good every time we've played him. There's a couple of minutes to go here. It's going to finish 4-2. Well done, Gary Megson. On this occasion, you've won. But we pushed them close. Second half. We won that second half 2-0. 
on to the knockouts we go. Let's go and find out who our opponents will be in the first knockout round. Oof. There we have the end of the group then. We finished second place. Holland have won all of their games. Gary Megson has a flawless record as the Netherlands manager. Let's go and find out who we're going to play in this next round. All right, so it definitely doesn't work in the way that I thought it was going to work. We will play Denmark in the first knockout round. Denmark, where do they finish in their group? They finished second, runners up to Belgium in their group and we've managed to get them in the next round despite finishing runners up we will take it denmark will be our first knockout round opponent let's have a look at who else what other oh my words spain have got holland we have absolutely dodged a bullet there <laughs> we've dodged a bullet there it's spain holland switzerland germany belgium turkey croatia england despite being in the same group they play each other interesting slovakia russia portugal poland france italy big game there and then north macedonia denmark i feel like we've got a chance we've given ourselves a real chance in this next game we play them how many days in two days time next episode i will see you for that massive massive game can we book our place in the european championships quarterfinals with north macedonia that's what we're playing for in this next episode against denmark tell you what you need to do in the comments down below in today's video leave me your score predictions what do you think the score will be against denmark if you get it correct you will be the winner and i'll give you a round of applause or something but yeah leave them down in the comments below thank you so much for watching today if you've enjoyed the video leave a like if you enjoyed the content in general subscribe to the channel i'll see you soon have a lovely rest of your day Bye bye